Hello friends, let us learn today on the new topic that is heart nub disease. So heart nub disease, it is an autosomal recessive condition and it is caused by a defect in absorption or transport of neutral amino acids. So what is, um, what is mainly, what is the response, which gene is responsible for this? SLC6. A19 gene is responsible for it. So this gene will encode sodium dependent and chloride independent sodium dependent and chloride independent uh, neutral amino acid transporter. Uh, so if you see it is B plus a t1 so let me draw a diagram for this if this is the proximal convoluted tubule here there is a channel which will lead to the reabsorption of sodium and also amino acid that is neutral amino acid so this neutral amino acid this channel is b a t1 this is b naught okay Right, so this is sodium dependent chloride independent neutral amino acid transporter. So normally this sodium uh, dependent uh, chloride independent neutral amino acid transporter this will lead to the reabsorption of amino acid that is neutral amino acid and sodium. But whenever there is mutation in this, uh, G, this protein then there is excretion of amino acid and uh, sodium. So this will uh, cause several uh, manifestations, right? So what are the major amino acids which are here? The amino acid, it, it occurs not only in the PCT, it also occurs in intestinal tubule also. Intestinal transporter, intestine also, small intestine. That is intestinal lumen. Just think that it, it, when it can also occur in intestinal lumen. Most commonly small intestine. Okay. So now there is amino acids. What are the amino acids which are involved? They are tryptophan. Mostly tryptophan. So here there is. So because there is no absorption of these amino acids. So in the intestine. Tryptophan is retained in the intestine, Reti retained in intestine. So because tryptophan is retained in the intestine, this is converted to indole compounds in intestine. And these indole compounds cause cerebellar ataxia. And they are toxic to CNS. And then there is no tryptophan. So there is no niacin. Because niacin is produced from tryptophan. That is niacin deficiency. So because of niacin deficiency, there is pellagra like skin rash. Okay, so this is seen. So how do you treat it? Treatment by alleviate high protein diet. Don't use, avoid, avoid. Alleviate is avoid. High protein diet. Sorry, sorry. You should not avoid high protein diet. Here the proteins are lost. Yeah? So you should give high protein diet. I'm really sorry. You should give high protein diet and you should also give niacin supplements. Okay, so this is about heart nub disease. Thank you guys for watching my lecture. If you have any doubts, comment it in the comment section. Please subscribe to this channel. In my next lecture, I will explain about dense disease. So thank you guys for watching my lecture. Thank you.